What's going on guys? Sub I'm Saint bringing you another review this week and this week we're going to take a look at a pre-release of an e-juice called Islander e-liquid. This was sent to me by Wolfpack Wholesale Distribution for the purposes of this review. Now what this e-juice is called is Islander e-liquid. That's right Islander. Yeah make you guys want to go back to the beach don't it? Now I did upload yesterday. I'm so sorry if you guys didn't see it. Um, my video did mess up on me. I guess I unplugged my camera from my computer on mistake. And when I uploaded it, it didn't fully upload. So it's just, it made a terrible mess. So I was like, you know what? I'm just going to have to re-record. Usually I leave my videos on my camera until like my next review or after it's uploaded. But sometimes I forget and then whenever I go to upload onto my computer, you know, I have like six videos on there. So this time I actually deleted it from my camera and then it messed up and then I didn't have it on my camera. So now I'm re-recording it all over again. So bummer, but hey, what are you going to do guys? So anyways guys, now about this juice, it is expected to hit market on May 3rd of 2016. Now, this juice is a 70 PG, 30 VG, comes in nick level of 0, 3, 6, and 12. Now, as you guys can see behind me, they do have a website, islandereliquid.com. Uh, as you can see, it says coming soon. There's not really much on there right now because obviously they haven't released. Now, on to the best part guys, I know you're going to like this. Now for a 15 ml bottle of this juice is $9, 30 ml bottle for it is $15. So hey, vape budget friendly and you're getting premium juice guys because this juice is really, really good. Now I'm going to go ahead and read off the back of the box that they sent me here. Now. It says, imagine living the life of an Islander and enjoying a taste of the tropics every day. With Islander e-liquids, you can escape to the islands every day with delicious, eh, delicious flavors that per eh, perfectly capture the magic of the Islanders. All Islander e-liquids are made in the U.S. And with love in the islands in our hearts. Escape to the Islanders every day with Islander e-liquids. Now, it does consist of three flavors. Now, Beach Bum, Hula Girl, and Sun Seeker. So, I'm going to go ahead and cover some of these juices for you guys. Now, what I have here first off is Beach Bum. Let me go ahead and show you guys the label. All the bottles are really cool. They got like a nice blue tint to them. I don't know if you guys can see it. I don't know if my camera is focusing quite right. But... It is pretty cool. I love their bottles. I think they are really well designed. Just perfect. Perfect. But anyways, guys. So, Beach Bum's flavor profile is a refreshing berry and pomegranate blend with a splash of pineapple. Now, what I have here is the 44 by Lit Up Customs DNA 200. I'm leaking everywhere too, man. Woo. Okay, let me see here. All right, with the Goon RDA sitting on top, I have a eight wrap, 24 gauge build, 0.36 ohms and 75 watts. Pretty much have the same build, same temp throughout on all my devices that I am flavor testing here. So let's go ahead and give Beach Bum a try. Oh man, that is good. And what I get with this one for the berry, I kind of get like a blueberry-ish flavor to it. Definitely get the pomegranate throughout. Pineapple is, a, you get a little bit on the lips, you know, whenever whenever you first hit it, you lick the lips and, it, and you taste it and it, it tastes pineapple-y. Now you do get the pineapple throughout, you do get it a, a lot on the exhale. Oh. Man, that is just so good. Now, obviously with a higher PG, you're going to get better flavor than with Max VG. So, you're going to compromise flavor over clouds. But as you guys can see, man, you still get pretty good clouds now. Yep. 
pretty decent clouds, not too bad. Now all these juices are kind of a little bit on the sweet side. If you're like me, of course everything, taste buds are subjective. I do like my juices a little bit on the sweet side because whenever I'm at work I run tanks and I want to be able to taste the juice through my tank instead of it being muted. And I have had all these in my tank, my Heracles Plus. Everybody knows how I love my Heracles Plus. So definitely, definitely really good on flavor in a tank. So I highly recommend that. Now on to the next one. Now this one is one of my favorites. The next one we're gonna take a look at is Hula Girl. Got a nice little green and turquoise color here, or teal, however you guys wanna look. See how the blue bottle is? That's so cool, I like that. Anyways, I have the E-Fusion DNA 200 at 0.31 ohms, 75 white, wa white, or wife's. I don't know what the heck I was getting ready to say. But anyways, I got the Twisted Messes squared sitting on top. Now, the flavor profile on Hula Girl is a tropical blend of coconut and ripe banana topped with heavy cream. So, let's go ahead and give it a two, guys. Oh, you get the coconut on the inhale. It starts to deplete off whenever you get towards the exhale. The exhale, then you start... Then you start getting that banana flavor. And the banana flavor kind of similar and it symbolizes like the runt, bana candy banana runt flavor banana. I'm not really getting the heavy cream. I get a light blend of heavy, or not a light blend of heavy cream. That don't make no sense. But anyways, I get a light blend of cream throughout. It kind of just meshes it all together. It's just a perfect, perfect vape it kind of reminds me of a pina colada to be honest with you um i guess that's the closest thing i can kind of symbolize it with now it is really really good it's just so smooth it's just mm. just so well balanced and it's just it's just really 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 good mm. That is some good juice. Mm. After you lick your lips, it's just like, mmm. Alright, now, last but certainly not least. Look at this, fogging it up. Clouds for days, bruh! Anyways, now, Sunseeker here. Check it out. Got a nice little orange label on it. So, Sunseeker is an adventurous blend of melon with a hint of sparkling citrus. So, go ahead and... Make sure I don't get a little bit of dry hit here, guys, because I don't want to get a dry hit on camera because then you guys be laughing at me. Now, <laughs> anyways, this flavor is really hard for me to pinpoint. I don't know if you guys have ever had a flavor that you taste it, but you couldn't... You, it tastes it similar to something, but you can't quite put your tongue on it. Like, this one reminds me of something, but it's like... Mm, what is that? And I can't remember. I just can't think of what it reminds me of. So, I have the Panzerbox DNA 200 with the Dot Mod version 2. Standard 7 wrap, 24 gauge canthal. Might be 8 wrap. It's 0 0.37 ohms. I have it at 70 watts. Let's go ahead and try out Sunseeker, guys. Alright, now the flavor I get with this one kind of reminds me of Airheads. You know, the Airheads, you know, the little candy, a a taffy Airheads, whatever they are. And it reminds me of that. It kind of reminds me of like the wa uh, white, kind of like the white one, the mystery flavor Airhead. That's what it reminds me of. Kind of seemed like it tastes a little bit of watermelon in there. Citrus, you definitely get the citrus a little bit on the uh, on the inhale, on the back of your throat. Kind of, you know, you get that little citrus burn on the back. Oh, foggy, man. Now, 
you definitely get the citrus throughout, but you definitely get it mostly on the inhale. Does remind me of kind of like a watermelon white mystery airhead in my opinion. I don't know if that makes sense to you guys or if you guys can quite put your tongue on that, but it is very, very good. It's just, mm. Yeah, it's got to be what it tastes like, man. Ah. Oh, it's so good. So good. All right. That right there, guys, is my review on Islander e-liquids. Definitely, definitely gets two thumbs up by some of them saying, look at that, got a little bit of juice on my thumb, man. Walking around with shiner thumb. Now, anyways, guys, definitely give it two thumbs up. This juice is really, really good. It is a perfect all-day vape. Great in tanks. It's perfect time of the perfect time weather for this juice it's just so phenomenal they're all tropically they do remind you of the island so i definitely definitely recommend it guys so definitely check them out and as always guys come back for more of the nitty and the gritty don't forget to leave a like comment subscribe do whatever you guys want to do and please answer the call to actions as always i will leave a link to the down in the description to Islander E-Liquids Wolfpack Wholesale Distribution and also Islander E-Liquids Instagram page. Go over there and give them guys a follow, guys. They don't have that many followers as of now because obviously they haven't released. So go back, give them a follow. I will leave a link in the description. Also, answer all the calls to action and support your right to vape by visiting down below kasa.org, notblowingsmoke.org, and vaping militia.org guys please sign up it takes two minutes just to simply just sign up get your name in there they will email you any calls to action all you do is sign in answer write the note or whatever it is and then you just fill out the sheet send it off and you're done guys that's all you got to do please support your right to vape if you are a vapor like me i love vaping I don't want to go back to cigarettes, and I won't go back to cigarettes. So, anyways, guys, I want you guys to please do that for me if you can. And as always, see you guys next time for the nitty and the gritty.